in the Midwest, it's been known since the uh, 1930s. Wow. As mudjacking. Mudjacking in its true sense does not incorporate a cement powder fused Portland Type 1A. Um, we are the only ones, to our knowledge, that have the ability to calibrate it. And we have agreements with volumetric mixer manufacturers in place that they will only produce these type of units for us. Um, what we've done is obviously made a number of proprietary modifications. There are different gates. Now you can't, we have it all locked down yeah. just so that nobody uh, plays with our stuff at McDonald's when we go to lunch. <laughs> yeah. But there are different gate settings, but everything comes through here dry. And you can see it's a, it's a nice dry material. We don't have to worry about waste. The water comes through. It goes through a, a modified augering system. And then drops into either a wheelbarrow or a, a powerized cart. This application that it you're was working actually in. designed for ready mix applications for uh, hot loads and short loads um, as a way to produce fresh material on site for the concrete contractor that instead of calling out the barrel truck, they could produce what they wanted to the consistency that they wanted it on site, on location. They didn't have to worry about. What is the molecular makeup of my material and the structural uh, composition of my material at 3 p.m. versus when that barrel track left at 7 a.m.? Because they're churning all day and they're adding water and they're trying to keep it. Can I film this? Yep. Okay.